E. Good afternoon, brothers and sisters. May we invite you to join us in our prayers today. Let us include in our prayers the following intentions for the needs and intentions of the Greenbelt Chapel community, for all of us here present and the members of our families, and also for those who have asked for our prayers. Let us continue praying for all the victims of violence, war, and natural calamities. The Holy Rosary. Please all kneel. In the name of the Father, of the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Come, Holy Spirit, fill the heart of your faithful and enkindle in them the power of your love. Send forth your spirit, and they shall be created. And you shall renew the face of the earth. Let us pray. O God, who by the light of the Holy Spirit did instruct the hearts of the faithful, grant that the same Spirit we may be truly wise and ever rejoice in his consolation. To Christ our Lord. Amen. Thou, O Lord, will open my lips. And my tongue shall announce thy praise. Incline into my aid, O God. O Lord, make haste to help me. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be world without end. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under and Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell, on the third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven, and is seated at the right hand of God the Father Almighty. From there he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, Hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, <coughs> pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be world without end. Amen. The Luminous Mystery The first luminous mystery, the baptism of Christ in the River Jordan. Let us offer this mystery for the needs and intentions of our Holy Father, Pope Francis, for his good health, safety, and protection. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. 
Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of your mercy. Mother Mary, we beg you, please bring peace to our families, to our country, and to the whole world. Amen. The second luminous mystery is the wedding feast at Cana. Let us offer this mystery for the needs and intentions of the church and the world, for wisdom and guidance for all church and government leaders, for their good governance and true conversion. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for our sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, 
Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Glory, Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, it's now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of your mercy. Mother Mary, we beg you, please bring peace to our families, to our country, and to the whole world. Amen. Amen. The third luminous mystery, the proclamation of the coming of the kingdom of God. Let us offer this mystery for the complete healing and recovery of all who are sick and for those who care for them, that they may find comfort and protection in their time of need. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of your mercy. Mother Mary, we beg you, 
please bring peace to our families, to our country, and to the whole world. Amen. The fourth luminous mystery is the transfiguration of Jesus. Let us offer this mystery for all our personal needs and intentions, and the needs and intentions of all the members of our families, relatives, loved ones, and friends, and for all those who have asked for our prayers, especially the intentions offered by the Greenville Chapel community. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Glory, Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, it's now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of your mercy. Mother Mary, we beg you, please bring peace to our families, to our country, and to the whole world. Amen. Amen. The fifth luminous mystery, the institution of the Holy Eucharist. Let us offer this mystery for all the souls in purgatory, especially the souls of our beloved dead relatives and friends, and those who died with no one to pray for them. Eternal rest grant unto them, O Lord. And let perpetual light shine upon them. May they rest in peace. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. 
Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of your mercy. Mother Mary, we beg you, please bring peace to our families, to our country, and to the whole world. Amen. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy. Hail our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To you do we cry, for banish children of Eve. To do do we send up our sight, mourning and weeping in this body of tears. Turn the most gracious advocate, your eyes of mercy towards us. And after this, our exile, so unto us the blessed fruit of your womb, Jesus. O clement, so loving, O sweet Virgin Mary. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, had purchased for us the rewards of eternal life, grant we beseech you that meditating upon these mysteries, of the most holy rosary of the blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise to the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Remember, O most gracious Virgin Mary, that never was it known that anyone who pled to thy protection, employed thy help, or sought thy intercession was left unaided. Inspired by this confidence, I ply unto thee, O Virgin of Virgin, my mother, to thee do I come, before thee I stand, simple and sorrowful. O Mother of the Word incarnate, not my petition, but in thy mercy, hear and answer me. Amen. Amen. O Saint Joseph, foster father of Jesus, most pure spouse of the Virgin Mary, pray for us daily to the same Jesus, the Son of God, that we, being defended by the power of his grace, and striving faithfully in life, may be crowned by him at the hour of death. Amen. Amen. Divine child Jesus, Santo Nino de Paz, bless and protect us. Saint Joseph, pray for us. Padre Pio of Petrachina, pray for us. All the angels and saints, pray for us. Saint Michael the Archangel, defend us in battle. Be our defense against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And do thou, O Prince of the heavenly host, by the power of God, thrust into hell Satan and all the evil spirits who prowl about the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. Act of entrustment to Saint Pio of Pietralcina. O glorious Saint Pio of Pietralcina, 
you are our friend, consoler of our soul, and helper of our sinners. You understand us so well, for you know what it means to suffer. To you we entrust our well-being and that of our loved ones. To you we entrust our spirit that we may be able to enjoy the pain we carry in our heart. To you we entrust the request of presenting our soul to the vision of praise to obtain eternal salvation from the Lord. To you we entrust our plea of intercession to obtain from the divine goodness the grace which we do other day a desire. Welcome us under your protection. Depend us from the snares of evil, and above all, intercede for us before the Holy, the Most High, so that through the forgiveness of sin, we may persevere in doing good. To Christ our Lord. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be world without end. Amen. Let us now pray the Angelus. Please all kneel. The angel of the Lord declare unto Mary, And she conceived of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be it done unto me according to your word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the word was made flesh. And dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. For forth we beseech you, O Lord, your grace into our hearts, that we, to whom the incarnation of Christ your Son was made known by the message of an angel, may by his passion and cross be brought to the glory of his resurrection. To the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be world without end. Amen. May the divine assistance remain always with us. Amen. And may the soul of the faithful departed to the mercy of God rest in peace. Amen. And may the blessing of Almighty God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit descend upon us and remain with us always. Amen.
Good evening, brothers and sisters. To preserve the solemnity of our celebration, let us please turn off our cell phones or put them on silent mode. Thank you for your cooperation. We have some announcements. We will be having our Way of the Cross every Friday of Lent after the 6 p.m. Mass, except on February 23 and March 1. Everyone is invited to join the Tuesday Praise and Worship after the 6 p.m. Mass. With music, prayer, and thanksgiving, let us celebrate our faith and find hope in the Lord. You are invited to our regular healing Mass every fourth Tuesday of the month during the 6 p.m. Mass. You are invited to the liturgical Bible study of Father Francis Gustilo, SDB, every Wednesday after the 6 p.m. Mass. In partnership with the Assumption College Counselors and Sister Ami Hernandez of Verbum Dei Missionaries, Greenbelt Chapel is offering free counseling for individuals, couples, and families. You may schedule an appointment through the chapel office or call 7729-8173. The book, It's All About Relationship by our chaplain, Father Dave Concepcion, is now available again at the chapel office. For more information, you may visit the Facebook page of the chapel. Welcome to the Holy Sacrifice of the Mass. Today is Thursday after Ash Wednesday, February 15, 2024. Our presider for this Holy Sacrifice of the Mass is Reverend Father Dave Concepcion. Please stand and let us sing our entrance We begin our celebration in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. To prepare ourselves to participate in the sacred mysteries, let us first call to mind our sins and humbly ask the Lord for his pardon and mercy. Lord Jesus, you came to reconcile us to, the, to one another. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord Jesus, you heal the wounds of sin and division. Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord Jesus, you intercede for us with your Father. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us of our sins, and bring us all to everlasting life. Amen. Let us pray. Prompt our actions with your inspiration, we pray, O Lord, and further them with your constant help, that all we do may always begin from you, and by you be brought to completion. 
through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. A reading from the book of Deuteronomy. Moses said to the people, Today I have set before you life and prosperity, death and doom. If you obey the commandments of the Lord your God, which I enjoin on you today, loving him, and walking in his ways, and keeping his commandments, statutes, and decrees. You will live and grow numerous, and the Lord your God will bless you in the land you are entering to occupy. If, however, you turn away your hearts and will not listen, but are led astray and adore and serve other gods, I tell you now that you will certainly perish. You will not have a long life on the land that you are crossing the Jordan to enter and occupy. I call heaven and earth today to witness against you. I have set before you life and death, the blessing and the curse. Choose life then that you and your descendants may live by loving the Lord your God, heeding his voice and holding fast to him. For that will mean life for you, a long life for you, to live on the land that the Lord swore he would give to your fathers, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Blessed are they who hope in the Lord. Blessed are they who hope in the Lord. Blessed the man who follows not the counsel of the wicked, nor walks in the way of sinners, nor sits in the company of the insolent, but delights in the law of the Lord and meditates on his law day and night. Blessed are they who hope in the Lord. He is like a tree planted near running water that yields its fruit in due season and whose leaves never fade. Whatever he does prospers. Blessed are they who hope in the Lord. Not so the wicked, not so. They are like chaff which the wind drives away. For the Lord watches over the way of the just, but the way of the wicked vanishes. Blessed are they who hope in the Lord. Together, Re repent, says the Lord, the kingdom of heaven is at hand.
The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Luke. Glory to you, O Lord. Jesus said to his disciples, The Son of Man must suffer greatly and be rejected by the elders, the chief priests, and the scribes, and be killed, and on the third day be raised. Then he said to all, If anyone wishes to come after me, he must deny himself, and take up his cross daily, and follow me. For whoever wishes to save his life will lose it, but whoever loses his life for my sake will save it. What profit is there for one to gain the whole world, yet lose or forfeit himself? The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. The discipline of Lent should remind us of who we are, where we are coming from, and where we are going. The discipline of Lent, fasting, almsgiving, and prayer should not make us feel good by simply doing it. It should bring us to the reality of who we are who we are. That we came to this world with nothing, we will leave this world with nothing. As Teresa of Avila would say, do not forget, you only have one soul. You only have one death and one life. One soul one death, one life. So, whatever you are trading yourself on, be careful. Because you might have everything in this world and at the end, you lose them. Why? You came with nothing and you will leave with nothing. Worse, you will lose even the very soul that God has given you. Think. Think of your priorities. Think of your priorities. The first reading reminds us of what? Begin with the end in mind. Begin with the end in mind. Who are we? We are created with freedom to make a choice. The first reading says, you have the power to choose life or to choose death. You have the power to choose prosperity or curse. Where do you put your hope? That's the response for your psalm. Blessed are they who hope in the Lord. You can never hope on your strength because someday everybody will get weak. What are your hopes? My dear friends, my brothers and sisters, nobody was buried with their cars. Nobody was buried with their money. Nobody. And the payers of old proven it wrong that everything that was buried with you remain here. Remain here. The gold, everything. Pagkamisan nga, yung iba sa atin, pag-araw ng patay, nag-aalay pa ng pagkain eh. Hindi po ba? Ano? Yung iba habang burol, nilalagay pa yung paboritong pagkain. Hindi po ba? Ano? Sigarilyo, chocolate, toothpick, kahit ano na lang. Bakit meron yan? gagamitin niya, Father. Saan? Saan? 
Habang sinusunog siya sa impyerno, nagtututwik siya. Come to think of it. Come to think of it, my dear brothers and sisters. We pray so that we will know the mind of God. We fast so that we detach ourselves of any inordinate attachment. We give alms to make amends of our sin. My dear friends, my brothers and sisters, as many times I have said this, who we are today are product of our choices. Where we will be, either heaven or hell, is a product of our choices. Again, many times I have said this, we can never point our fingers to anyone, blaming anybody for where we are today. We are a product of our choices. Sometimes we can blame our family why we are sick of this way. Kaya ako may hypertension kasi ang mga magulang ko hypertensive. Kaya ako diabetic kasi ang mga magulang ko diabetic. Whatever sickness, partly true. But majority of our sickness are product of what we eat, whether you like it or not. Because we become what we eat. Mga minamahal na mga kapatid. Kaya nga po sa araw na ito, inaanyayahan tayo. Take time to sit down and ask yourselves, what are my choices? What are the things I have chosen? Where this will bring me? Kanino ka galing? Galing ka sa Diyos. Dapat uuwi ka sa Diyos. Who you are today is a product of your choices. My dear friends, my brothers and sisters, stop trying to be popular. Stop trying to be accepted. Stop trying to be immortal. It will never happen. If you think you are indispensable in your work, wake up. No one is indispensable. If you die tomorrow, maybe some of them will cry. But one week after, they will have to get a replacement for you. Mahirap naman yun. Nagpakamatay ka sa trabaho, di ba? Ano? Ang natanggap mo lang bulaklak. Kung may nagdadasal, may mask card. Di po ba? Pero hindi sila lahat makipaglibing. At sa huli, makakalimutan ka rin nila. Ang mas malungkot na kwento, dahil wala kang relasyon sa sariling pamilya, ang sarili mong pamilya ang unang lilimot sa iyo. Pero ang mas malungkot kumpara doon ay ano? Nilimot man Diyos sa huli, aasahan mong matatandaan ka ng Diyos. Where you are, where you are going is a product of your choices. My dear friends, my brothers and sisters, again, the discipline of Lent would hopefully remind us of who we are, where we are coming, and where we are going. Do not forget, we only have one soul, one life, one death. Amen. Let us all rise and bring to God our prayers and petitions. Our Lord Jesus calls us to follow Him, to carry the cross after Him, and to entrust to Him all those who suffer. And every petition at a response, we Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear our prayer. That as members of the Church, we may imbibe in our lives the spirit of the cross, and be willing to suffer for the sake of Christ and the gospel. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear, hear our prayer. prayer. That the leaders of our country may hear the cries of suffering people and may show commitment to the eradication of oppression, 
and exploitation in society. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That those who are suffering, the poor, the sick, the handicapped, and the prisoners may never fall into despair, but experience the comfort of God's love. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That those who are alone in life may find companions who are willing to help them bear their crosses. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That our beloved dead may be one with God and their loved ones in heaven for all eternity. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. In the silence of our hearts, let us also bring to God our own personal prayers and petitions. For this we pray. Lord, Amen. hear our prayer. God, our loving Father, the passion and death of your Son brought life to the world. Help us to recognize the crosses and sufferings, not just in the great trials of life, but in day-to-day -day choices. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Blessed are you, Lord of all creation, to goodness this bread to all the fruit of the earth, to the heavenly sin, may the fruit of the forest to the Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, to goodness this wine to all the fruit of the earth, to the heavenly sin. It will become for us a spiritual good. Lord God, we ask you to receive us. Pray, brothers and sisters, that the sacrifice of yours and mine be made acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and the good of all his holy church. Regard with favor, O Lord, we pray, the offerings we set upon the sacred altar, that bestowing on us your pardon, our obligation, our oblation, may give honor to your name through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere, to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, for you will that our self-denial should give you thanks, humble our sin sinful pride, contribute to the feeding of the poor, and so help us imitate you in your kindness. And so we glorify you with countless angels as with one voice of praise we acclaim. Holy, holy, holy Lord God of hosts, heaven and earth are full of your glory. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. You therefore, Almighty Father, we bless through Jesus Christ, your Son, who comes in your name. He himself is the word that brings salvation the hand you extend to sinners, the way by which your peace is offered to us. 
when we ourselves had turned away from you on account of our sins, you brought us back to be reconciled, O Lord, so that converted at last to you, we might love one another through your Son, whom for our sake you have handed over to death. And now, celebrating the reconciliation Christ has brought us, we entreat you to sanctify these gifts by the outpouring of your Spirit, that they may become the body and blood of your Son, whose command we fulfill when we celebrate these mysteries. For when about to give his life to set us free, as he reclined at supper, he himself took bread into his hands, and giving you thanks, he said the blessing, broke the bread, gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it. For this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, on the same evening, he took the chalice of blessing in his hands, confessing your mercy, and gave the chalice to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. We proclaim your death, O Lord, and profess your resurrection until you come again. Celebrating, therefore, the memorial of the death and resurrection of your Son, who left us this pledge of his love, we offer you what you have bestowed on us, the sacrifice of perfect reconciliation. Holy Father, we humbly beseech you to accept us also together with your Son, and in this saving banquet, graciously to endow us with His very Spirit who takes away everything and estranges us from one another. May He make your church a sign of unity, an instrument of your peace among all people. And may He keep us in communion with Francis, our Pope, Jose, our Bishop, all the bishops, and your entire people. Father, Please hear the prayers of your children gathered here before your holy presence. Let's spend a few moments of silence. And I invite you, brothers and sisters, that you personally ask the Lord for a special grace you want to receive in this Eucharistic celebration. Ask the Lord. Just as you have gathered now at the table of your sons, so also bring us together with the glorious Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with Saint Joseph, our most chaste spouse, with your blessed apostles, with Padre Pio, Petrochina, and all the saints, with our brothers and sisters, those of every race and tongue who have died in your friendship. Bring us to share with them the unending banquet of unity, in a new heaven, in a new earth, where the fullness of your peace will shine forth in Christ Jesus, our Lord. Through him and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever.
Gathering all our prayers into one, let us now pray to the Father in the very words our Lord Jesus Christ taught us. Our, our Father, Father who art in heaven, heaven hallowed, hallowed be thy name. name. Thy, thy kingdom, kingdom come, thy will, will be done, done on earth as it is in heaven. heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all unnecessary worries and distress, as we await the blessed hope in the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace, I leave you my peace, I give you. Kindly look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant us peace within our hearts, peace in our mind, peace in our own homes, in our own families, peace in our workplace, peace in our community, peace in our country and in the world, and grant unity in accordance with your will, who lives and reign forever and ever. Amen. My dear brothers and sisters, the peace of our Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us now bless one another by giving each other the sign of peace. Peace be with you. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Grant us peace. My dear brothers and sisters, this is Jesus, the Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are you who are invited here to receive him in holy communion. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed. May the body and blood of Christ bring us to everlasting life. Amen. For a solemn reception of communion, we will do it row by row. Please follow the guidance of our ushers. Also, please consume the host immediately after receiving them in front of the minister.
Let us pray the prayer of Padre Pio Petrucina. Please all kneel. Stay with me, Lord, for it is necessary to have you present so that I do not forget you. You know how I easily abandon you. Stay with me, Lord, because I am weak and I need your strength, that I may not fall so often. Stay with me, Lord, for you are my life, and without you I am without fervor. Stay with me, Lord, for you are my light, and without you I am in darkness. Stay with me, Lord, to show me your will. Stay with me, Lord, so that I hear your voice and follow you. Stay with me, Lord, for I desire to love you very much and always be in your company. Stay with me, Lord, if you wish me to be faithful to you. Stay with me, Lord, for as poor as my soul is, I want it to be a place of consolation for you, a nest of love. Stay with me, Jesus, for it is getting late and the day is coming to a close and life passes, death, judgment, eternity approaches. It is necessary to renew my strength so that I will not stop along the way and for that I need you. It is getting late and death approaches. I fear the darkness, the temptations, the dryness, the cross, the sorrows. Oh, how I need you, my Jesus, in this night of exile. Stay with me tonight, Jesus, in life with all its dangers, I need you. Let me recognize you as your disciples did at the breaking of the bread, so that the Eucharistic communion be the light which disperses the darkness, the force which sustain me, the unique joy of my heart. Stay with me, Lord, because at the hour of my death, I want to remain united to you, if not by communion, at least by grace and love. Stay with me, Jesus. I do not ask for divine consolation because I do not merit it, but the gift of your presence. Oh, yes, I ask this of you. Stay with me, Lord, for it is you alone I look for. Your love, your grace, your will, your heart, your spirit, because I love you and ask no other reward but to love you more and more. With a firm love, I will love you with all my heart while on earth and continue to love you perfectly during all eternity. Amen. Let us pray. Please stand. Having received the blessing of your heavenly gifts, we humbly beseech you, Almighty God, that they may always be for us a source both of pardon and of salvation through Christ our Lord. Amen. We constantly remind ourselves that we only have one life, one soul, one death. And we have the freedom to make a choice. The choice between life and death, between prosperity and curse, the choice between heaven and hell. My dear friends, the discipline of Lent, hopefully, hopefully, when we pray, we will know the will of God for us. When we fast, we detach ourselves from any inordinate attachment and we give alms knowing, knowing that we came with nothing, we will live with nothing. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Bow your heads and pray for God's blessing. May Almighty God, who made known to your people the way of eternal life, lead them by that path we pray, O Lord, to you, the unfading light. This we ask through Christ our Lord. Amen. And may Almighty God bless you and your family, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. We now go in peace to love and serve the Lord. Thanks be to God.
Thank you, sisters and brothers, for coming to celebrate the Mass with us. May you all have a safe